that time again. <laughs> uh, uh, all right, as I've said in the last review, I apologize for any screaming or tear shedding or crying or just straight up a anything like that that you might hear in the background of this video because my brother is being a a, a level 1000 bitch right now and he's causing problems. I figured, you know, with my brother screaming and everything, what, what better thing could I do than come up here and make a bunch of reviews and share the experience with you guys. That's why you're here. But I can't talk about that because today what I have to talk about is the America Provost skate shoe from America, from Colin Provost. It's a skate shoe. I'm talking about it here. So uh, let's get in depth with this. So to start off, this shoe is uh, all suede shoe, um, and then almost all suede actually. Uh, as you move to the inner part of the foot, you have this mesh panel here for your breathability, so your feet aren't getting all stanky. And it does a very good job of keeping your feet fresh. Um, and then, holy shit, listen to them. The durability of this shoe, it was, uh, on a scale of one to 10, I give it a solid 7.5. The suede on the shoe held up very well. I skated this shoe for about four weeks, and I know I put the shoe goo on there, but I, that was recent. So uh, most of the time I was skating this shoe without shoe goo on it. And as you can see, there's no holes. There's one developing right over there-ish, right down the middle of the shoe. But other than that, there's literally no holes on this shoe. I'm sure if I kept skating this for a while longer, there would be a, a massive hole that developed here just because that's how all my shoes end up. But there's nothing wrong with it right now. Moving back on the shoe, you got this little ollie panel right here that it didn't come up for me. So that's a good thing. Moving back the shoe, the little panel that most people rip on heel flips didn't do anything. So that's a plus. Moving to ankle support and tongue stuff about this shoe. The ankle support in the shoe, honestly, it, 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 well, I wore these around a lot before I actually started skating them. And if you walk around in your shoes a lot, it'll really screw with the ankle support. Like, seriously. Because I wore these around for like a good six months before I actually started doing some some shredding in them. But anyway, the ankle support, it does hold your ankle very well at first. But as I said, I've, I've had these for a while, so it, it's kind of squishy. It kind of caves in and stuff like that. So it might not have the best ankle support. And then the tongue is literally just about as thin as it gets other than Janowski's. It's... It's basically just a piece of suede with a little bit of padding just, just sandwiched in between there. You can squeeze it and tell that there's a bit in there, but it's not going to do that much. And that kind of goes along with what this shoe was constructed for, which was like almost like a rounds cruiser, but thinner. And that's pretty much what this shoe is. The grip on the bottom on this shoe is America's Tri-Angle Tread Pattern. It's on most of their shoes, so you guys are probably used to it by now. You guys know what it looks like. You guys know how it skates. But uh, for me, it skated very well. It, it didn't get any any little flat spots. It was starting to get one right there on the ball of my foot right there, but it didn't go through. What's kind of cool about the grip on this shoe is that it's got the uh, hardened rubber on all the main areas that they need to be. Like, uh, heel drag didn't wear out for me. I'm assuming that's because of the hardened rubber that they put there on the heel for that specific purpose to not make it wear out. And then as you move up the grip, you have this little piece of hard rubber here too and that is to deflect primos and then this round the toe that is just for toe drag I think that it does a really good job with all those things primo didn't hurt bad for me in these I didn't get a hole from toe drag I didn't get a hole from heel drag uh, so I am satisfied now impact in these shoes I lost the insole because um, I, I don't know why but the insole in these is the same thing as the insole in the America Reynolds, which is pretty much just uh, there for sweat absorption and comfort. So yeah, there's not a lot for impact on these, which can be expected because, uh, as I've said, it's supposed to be a slimmed out Reynolds Cruiser. The Reynolds Cruiser didn't have an asshole of impact stuff in the first place, so you should expect even less from this. But, uh... Yeah, th that's pretty much what the insole looks like on these. And I apologize if I'm getting darker as the video goes on because the sun is going down. But um, anyway, uh, yeah, the shoe, overall, the shoe, 
Definitely provides the maximum, one of the maximum amounts of board feel that you can get an issue. It is relatively durable and it skates incredibly well whenever you, f whenever you start actually skating them. The shape is very pointy, so it flicks really good on flip tricks. And um, overall, I could just say that this is a great shoe. Uh, maybe not the best for jumping down the giant gaps because not a lot of impact support in this right here. But other than that, it's definitely a good shoe. If you have the money and you want to get a pair, I would definitely say to do it because it's just a really solid shoe all around. I really enjoy skating it and I'm probably going to keep skating it for a little while because it's not even worn out that much. So that's my thoughts on the America Provost. Feel free to check out some other videos that I have. Uh, feel free to like, comment, any questions, share if you want to tell all your friends about the America Provost. And uh, subscribe for more. Hash. Uh, I'll talk to you guys next time, and which will most likely be another shoe review. So stay tuned for that. Check out the rest of my channel and have a fabulous. Have a fabulous. I'm speaking like you. Yeah, you still have a.